Hello everyone, my name is Yvonne Zhang and I'm currently a student from University of Central Florida. Over the past summer, I interned with Cummins and my main project was to utilize GT Suite's uh, design of experiment functionality, particularly the Monte Carlo feature to conduct vibration analysis on engine rigid body. I worked on this project with my internship mentor, Bibu, and today I will be presenting how we achieved this analysis as well as show the results of our findings. So the objective statement for our analysis is to understand engine vibration and ultimately develop a methodology for engine vibration quantification due to some of the crank train mass variation using gamma technology tools. And our goal is to ultimately conclude if there's any changes that we need to make towards the manufacturing tolerances. Uh, some of the project details, uh, we did decide to go and use the inline six cylinder as the I6 engine is inherently balanced, um, but there will be some mass variation in some rotating or reciprocating components due to manufacturing tolerance, which can result in um, imbalanced forces. So our study was to estimate the worst case mount vibration amplitude due to these um, tolerances. And um, later on, I will also explain how uh, we decided to go with the force frequency analysis instead of the time domain analysis so that we can cut down simulation time significantly. Now we're gonna start by asking the question why engine balance is important. Uh, engine balance is important because it adds smoothness, performance, and longevity to our engine, as well as reduce wear, noise, and vibration while the engine is running. So it is a very important parameter for us to quantify while designing an engine. There are two forces that we will focus on during this project, and that is the primary and secondary forces, also known as the first order and second order forces. So the primary forces comes from reciprocating and rotating components. It occurs at engine speed, and it usually occurs when the forces are not canceled out in opposite directions.